What? <laughs> what did I do there? Hello everybody, welcome to Chaz Draycott Media and welcome to another episode of Tower Simulator 3. In this episode today we're going to be looking at another brand new airport that is coming to the game. As I've mentioned in a few others, I'm one of the beta testers for the game. Unfortunately I've had a lot of stuff going on at the moment which means I've not been able to do too much beta testing I'm afraid. However, we're going to be looking at Harry Reid International Airport today from Las Vegas in Nevada. It's an airport that's very interesting to me. It's got a very odd shape about it. There are runways that sort of cross over each other, which is not something I normally enjoy and not something I get on well with. I mean, you've all watched me play LaGuardia. However, this is a very busy airport with lots of different terminals, many different shapes. You have to be so careful about aircraft pushing back onto each other here. Obviously, this is still in beta at the moment, so please do not take any of this as completely final. This is just me trying to show you how the game works how this airport works and any fixes that these guys have will be obviously looked at before release. Admittedly I did do a quick check just to make sure that the airport loads in okay, the frame rates are alright again since the last time I downloaded it for beta testing. I think it's been about a week and a bit since I last updated it. There's still a lot of flights for it to load in as you can see. We're not using world colour and world traffic today, we're just going to be using the standard airlines in the game which I've probably forgotten by now to be honest so we'll have to see how I can crack on with that and whether I can get it right. Still been having issues with my keyboard as well. I've got this beautiful Rockat AMO 100 or 120 Vulcan keyboard but the A and D key have unfortunately given up on me and as you can imagine for someone that plays Counter-Strike that is not a good thing. Frame rate's a little bit low at this airport, there are a lot of gates and it's very very busy as you can see here. Lots of taxiways to think about when you zoom in, look there's loads here, Hotel Papa 2, Sierra 15, Whiskey, Golf, Zulu, loads of it. Uh, we're using runways 26 right and 26 left for today and I'm going to have them all coming in this way. Arrivals coming in on 2-6 left, and then hopefully offer either Alpha 6 or 7, and then they can wait and cross the runway from there. And then we'll get them in, coming in on Golf. Magic two nine okay. five six with information delta, requesting push and start. Magic 29056, pushback approved. Expect runway 2-6 right. For some reason, Ground. Two six I don't right. have the little pushback approved. tick noise anymore. Magic 29056. Interesting. Is that something on here that I've changed? I don't know if you can't hear You can hear that in the video, but... No. I don't have the little tick of when I... There's a little radio crackle noise. In my ear, anyway. Six, six, two, Fox Tango with information I don't Delta. know. Ready to start. 662 Fox Tango. Pushback approved. Nope. 662 Fox Tango. Approved. Expect runway 26 right. They don't need pushback. Ground. Two, six, right. Got latitude Approved. coming in as well. Let's have a quick look six, around the six, airport, two, shall we? So the tower is up here with a good look over at everything. Look at the shape of this terminal here. There's sort of like an observation tower down there. I imagine that's probably for ground when people are pushing back because they could easily push back into each other. That's what I mentioned a moment Las ago. Vegas, There's a couple ground. of heavies Magic here as well. Got latitude and a B there as well. Delta. Requesting Another terminal here, big pier there, and then there's bunches of piers there. And look at them all parked on the ground all together at this side. There's that magic pushing back. I think 662 Fox Tango is one of the little private jets over here somewhere. Let's go and have a look at it, shall we? It's actually a little Cessna by the look of it. There's the little sausage. Not really got any um, any sort of background noise going on either. Las Vegas ground. Magic 2956, runway 26 right via Charlie. 662 Fox Tango, runway 26 right via Whiskey Golf Charlie. Yeah, I'm not right. getting any uh, any noise from Magic Niner like the environment or anything, actually. Um, right. Bear with me two seconds, actually. Gold I'm just going to restart four, the game and just check five. this. <laughs> I've decided to restart the game. I don't think that's a game issue. I changed my headset between testing it when I just had it on my speakers before and then stayed in the game and then put my headset on and turned my audio mixer and all that sort of crap on. Okay, yeah, I've got menu music now, which is good. That was not something I had before. Uh, so we'll jump back in. Same situation as before. Uh, please do bear with me and we'll get up to where we were a second ago. When I see these videos back, I keep having a reminder that I really need a haircut, to be honest. It's a while since I've had the good old skin fade, and this mop up here is getting very tall. It's a bit solid, actually. I don't know if you've ever wondered what's Chaz's hair like, but it's not fluffy or soft. It's really solid and in place. I use quite a lot of hairspray on it. Anyway, that's, that's beyond the point. Let's get into this. There we go. Now we've got aerial volume, as they call it. So it's like the environment volume. 
which is lovely. That's what we want. Let's get the tag and icon sizes down a little bit, shall we? Sort that screen out and that as well. And yes, now we're going to be back into normal surroundings here. That was not a game issue. That was me changing headsets and audio output devices between sessions. Might actually just do that slightly, just so we can... Can we just give it one? Mm, not quite. We can kind of give it one notch more on that, but... Uh, Las Vegas ground. Yeah. Magic there they are. Straight back on cue. Push and start. Magic 2956 push back approved. Expect runway 26 right. And of course we have the tick-tock thingy-majig. There's Magic pushing back. On this lovely day at Harry Reid International. They're going to do a little turn around here and then go that way. Uh, we had 662 Fox Tango call up as well. 662 Fox Tango approved. Expect runway 26 right. Now they're all the way over that side Round. now, so they're Two much further right. down there. Approved. On six, six, two, that bit. Tango. Just see them flashing away over there. Whereas last time they were a bit further down here. Now Harry Reid International Ground. is Magic very close to a friend of mine actually, Fox Evan Pasoko, who took start. an amazing picture of a 747 SP that operates in and out of here every so often. Not too long ago, I think it was September last year he took that picture. Evan sees some amazing stuff in and out of here, a fellow plane spotting friend of mine. He flies all over the world as well with his job, he's got an incredibly cool job. And he's often Las back Vegas and forth Brown. to Germany Magic on 747s, bless him. The jammy b Magic 928 pushback approved, expect runway 26 right. Gold Sun 1435 pushback approved, expect runway 26 right. Right, let's try and figure out some of these taxiways here, shall we? Ground. Because we've got Charlie, right. which I want to get them out on. Magic Niner, Actually, eight. no, I don't. I want to get them out on Bravo, Bravo don't I? Six right. Let's Push get them out on Bravo, because then Charlie can be for one, four, three, incoming five. stuff. Uh, Golf and then Bravo we'll get them out on. And we'll try and get 662 Fox Tango to cross these ground. two runways and just Gold get straight on Bravo. Four, three, five, with information for yes, I know you there. I can, yeah, I've, I've, I've already dealt with you, mate. Magic 2956, runway 26 right via Golf Bravo. No one else ready yet. Magic 928 is pushing back over here Golf, somewhere. Magic two, nine, or five, six. There. Las Vegas ground. So there's 2956, that little tail there. This one's going to push on and turn. Las Vegas ground. Lovely. Magic one seven one nine with information Fox Trot. Okay. Requesting push and start. Magic one seven one nine are pushback approved. Expect runway two six right. Six six two Fox Tango runway two six right via Bravo. Love it. So they're going to turn down there and then all the way along there. Great stuff. So the important thing to look at in this game, if you've not really got too much experience with it, is these paths where they will push back, basically. You've just got to see how they join up to taxiways that other aircraft might be on. It's sometimes a little bit difficult to get your head around where the buildings are, but when you see a terminal like this shape, that one, it's very easy to tell what shape the building is, and they're the paths in which the aircraft push back. Wow. Patient 706 approved. Expect runway 19 are right. We're going to get them out on 19 right. Why not? Negative. We tried to push back by hand, but we failed. Please send a pushback truck. Patient oh. 706. Patient 706 pushback approved. Expect runway 19 right. Should say 19 are right as well, to be honest. Ground. Got the two magic aircraft ready to go here. One's just taxied past the other, as you see. Just gone through there. Plenty of noises going on and things starting up and all sorts. Goldstone 1435, runway 26 right via Bravo. Latitude 753, pushback approved. Expect runway 26 right. Runway 266 six, right. two Fox via Tango Bravo. across runway Gold 08. Ground 26 right, pushback approved. Latitude 753. Magic 928, runway 26 right via Golf Bravo. Magic 1719, runway 26 right via Golf Bravo. Cross runway 08 left. 662 Fox Tango. We've got this Gold Sun going out. It's quite a nice livery, actually, the Gold Sun one. Looks sort of uh, Eastern European, doesn't it? I like it. Look at these two here. Tasty. 
Where's Patience then? What is Patience? Is this just like a, a private jet? It's amongst all this lot here. Las Vegas ground. Six, six, two, ah, there you go. Request, it's like a zero, Bombardier global thing. It's a Silent Valley. Mm, it's nice, isn't it? That looks like Las Air Vegas China. Ground. That reminds me of Air China. All these like Gulf Streams and private jets and things. Like it. I like a private jet. Oh, I've not been managing my strips at all. Oh, latitude five nine or six runway two six left clear to land. Latitude five nine or six heavy runway two six left clear to land. Latitude five nine or six heavy runway two six left. Well, damn. Going around latitudes five and nine or six. Latitude five nine or six. Contact departure. Did I just say it wrong? Roger. Good day. Bye, mate. Sorry, bruv. <laughs> oh. Why is he on two six right? Oh, it's because I'm a moron and I opened two six right, didn't I? Because I clicked that. <laughs> I do silly things, don't I? Oh, dearie me. Well, bye, mate. See you in a bit. Okay, so they're on those ones we've got. Who else have we got now? 181 Sierra Tango. Pushback approved and expect runway 19 right. We tried to push back by hand, but we failed. Negative. Yeah. We don't need uh. pushback truck. Don't please approve our start. <laughs> ah, come on. We've got a lovely little uh, train of aircraft Latitude making their way down. Bravo, three, look. We've got one there. One there. And then those two. That's at least something positive to look at. <laughs> 181 Sierra Tango. Approved. Expect runway 190 right. 662 Fox Tango. Cross runway 08 left. Las Vegas Tower. Goldson 1335 on final 26 left. Goldson 1335. Runway 26 left. Clear to land. That's how you do it, Chaz. That is how you do it. Runway 26 left. Clear to land. Goldson 136. Goldson 1365. Pushback approved. Expect runway 26 right. 662 Fox Tango. Cross runway 19 right. Ground, two, there we go. Right. Okay, Pushback so you just need to tell them the right runway to cross. Goldson, one, three, six, oh, yeah, because that's 08 left, isn't it? Right. Not that one. Six, six, two, Fox Tango. Should know this, Chaz. Ground. Patience 706. Runway 19 right via Fox. 181 Sierra Tango, runway 19 right via Fox. Now I say Foxtrot just so I don't runway tempt right the voice control to not quite get it right. Location. Sorry, not voice control, voice recognition. Magic 2956, right. runway 26 right, clear for immediate takeoff. Upon Sierra reaching Tango. altitude 1000, contact departure. God, it feels like ages since I've done that. It's a while runway since I've recorded one of these right. videos, to be fair. Latitude 753, altitude, runway 26 right via departure. Bravo. Magic so they get on whatever taxiway you tell them to get on, they tend to get on it as soon as they can. So he's going to get on Bravo at the earliest opportunity and then head down there. So magic. Oh, wow. <laughs> what did I do there? Wow, there's a lot of private stuff. 746 Fox Tango approved. Expect runway 26 right. 662 Fox Tango, cross runway 19 left. What's this little sausage here? Ground, 26 right, approved. 746 Fox Tango. Okay, have we got next? Cross runway 19 left. Goldson 1435. Goldson 1435, runway 26 right, line up and wait. There we go, runway there is a successful right. departure from line Harry Reid International. Goldson, one, Our four, first three, on the five. channel. Las Vegas Tower, Goldson 406 on final 26 left. Are you now? Las Vegas ground. Goldson, Goldson 1335, three, runway 26 left, clear to land. Goldson 406, runway 26 left, clear to land. Already cleared 1335. Runway 26 left, clear to land. Goldson 406. Las Vegas ground, 746 Fox Tango, ready to taxi. 746 Fox Tango, runway 19 right via Fox. They're just going all the way runway up there, aren't they? Because right. that's Five Hotel Fox that they're on. 746 Fox Tango. Goldson 1435, runway 26 right. 
Clear trim. Goldson 1435, runway 26 right. Clear for immediate takeoff upon reaching altitude 1000, contact departure. I've never done that by mistake before of moving runway my camera. Right. Cleared for immediate takeoff uh, let's get patience lined up. Patience 706, runway 1 right, 9 right. Line up and wait. Flipping out. Alright, so they've runway been given right. takeoff clearance. We've got any arrivals yet? Are they over Last the threshold? Oh yeah, there they are. Oh, look at that. Look at that. One on departure. Just rotating as the other one touches down. That's really cool. Nice. Well, it's already nice and busy out here in Las Vegas, isn't it? So now they've taken off. Let's get Patience out of there. Patience 706, runway 19 are right. Cleared for immediate takeoff upon reaching altitude 1000 contact departure. Who's this? Magic 1719, runway 26 right. Line up and wait. Who wants push and start? Right. Two Goldsons. Goldson 1365, runway 26 right via Bravo. And then we'll wait for him to get past them and then they'll push back. Yep. Where are you going? Okay. Goldson 1335, taxi to ramp via Golf. They've cleared the runway, which is nice. Just over there. There's a tiny little Cessna on its way out. We've got beacon lights here from Goldson. I think there's another one on that sort of pier as well. Wants a push. You can see them down here, look. These two want to push back, but this one's taxiing down, so we're going to wait. That's the key to this game. It's knowing who you've told to push back and just keeping an eye on things. Sounds really daft and really obvious to say keep an eye on things as an air traffic controller, but you have to. Gold Sun 1174, runway 26 left clear to land. Denali's not going to call up yet, that's runway fine. But we've got a decent left. train of uh, aircraft land. coming in. Gold Sun 1174. Can we give takeoff clearance to 1719? Magic 1719 at runway 26 right, cleared for immediate takeoff upon reaching altitude 1000, contact departure. Runway 26 right, cleared for immediate taking for upon reaching altitude 1000 contact departure. We've got another magic, magic behind them. Okay, now we can tell these two taxi Denali or push back out at least. Goldson 253, one push back approved, expect runway 26 right. Who have we got up here ready to go? 181 Sierra Tango, right. runway 19 right, line up on wait. And then once this guy takes off, we'll then get Goldson right. over there. Line up and wait. One eight one Sierra Tango. Goldson one three eight one pushback approved. Expect runway two six right. Magic nine two eight runway two six right. Line up and wait. One eight one Sierra Tango is up. There's the departure. Right. Pushback approved. Goldson one three eight one. Goldson one three three five cross runway two six right. Goldson four zero six. Taxi to ramp via Golf. Goldson 406, cross runway 26 right. 181 Sierra Tango, runway 19 right, cleared for immediate takeoff upon reaching altitude 1000, contact departure. Any more arrivals? Denali 670, runway 26 left, cleared to land. Nice. Runway 26 right, line up and wait. Uh, Magic they're not on the ground yet. They've been given that. They've cross been given runway that. 26 right. Goldson 1335. Okay. Let's just wait to see Golf. Right. Yeah. 318 Quebec Hotel approved. I expect runway 19 right. I'll try and get the private stuff on 19 right just to keep it tidy. Okay, they're clearing. They're clearing the runway, which is great news. Magic 928 runway 26 right. Cleared for immediate takeoff upon reaching altitude 1000 contact departure. And there is ANG 1174 now on the ground as well. Nice. Some of them are still coming on 26 right. Why? Oh, I think it's maybe because they were lined up a long time before that. Okay, he's going in there, so that's fine. So we can get. Yep. Magic 3032, pushback approved, expect runway 26 right. Value 930, pushback approved, expect runway 26 right. Latitude 753, runway 26 right, line up and wait. Right. Quash. 318 Magic Quebec Hotel, runway 19 right via 
fox. Oh, they, they keep creeping up there. What taxiway is that? It is fox. Let's get them on whiskey fox. 318 Quebec Hotel, runway 19, right via whiskey fox. I want them there. That's, yes, exactly that. Exactly that. That's what I want. Let's get them like that. Latitude 753, runway 26 right, cleared for immediate takeoff upon reaching altitude 1000, contact departure. And then we'll get the other one to cross the runway. Latitude 596, runway 26 left, cleared to land. Runway 26 left, clear to land. Latitude 596. Las Vegas ground, 318 with This is nice. It's very busy, but it's not that impossible. Goldson 1381, runway 26 right, via Bravo. Goldson 2531, follow company. Runway 26 right, via Bravo. Goldson Interested to see whether they follow company. Follow company. Goldson 2531. Ah, uh, he's Vegas not, ground. is he? Goldson two five three one runway two six right via Bravo. Is that one ready to go? Magic three zero three two runway two six right via Golf Bravo. Goldson one one seven four cross runway two six right. Runway two six seven four six right. Fox Bravo. Tango runway one nine a right line up and wait. I like this airport. I like this. Normally, I don't like airports that cross over. We've got 1069er coming in. Just a sec, they'll call up to say that they're ready to land. Value 930, runway 26 right via Bravo. This is only a quick look at this, though, just to show you how it all works. What's that? Is that another Goldson? Goldson 2738, pushback approved. Expect runway at 26 right. Who's that? Field Air 1... Field Air 2134, pushback approved. Expect runway 26 right. 662 Fox Tango, runway 26 right, line up and wait. Gold Sun 1174. Taxi to ramp via Charlie. Nice. Gold Sun 1174, cross runway 26 right. Denali 670. Taxi to ramp via Golf Charlie. Ground two six right. Push back approved. Oh, they're going to go all the way down there. Does it become Charlie there, or is that Golf and then it becomes Charlie? That's fine. That's all good. I can't see any issues here. Can't see any issues. Can you? Oh, value. Naughty going that way. 662 Fox Tango, runway 26 right, cleared for immediate takeoff upon reaching altitude 12,000 contact departure. Alright, 4,000. No! Magic 3. Oh, I didn't know magic was. Yeah, okay. Right, let's go and have a look at this. So, this is what I've done. So, ah, yeah. So, they were going up there and magic was coming here, but I thought magic was going. Let's just try and give you a good view on this. I thought magic was going to go down this way and avoid this rather than going straight down there. But oh well, that's my mistake and that's exactly what happens when you do it. I mean, they didn't really do a great job at stopping in front of each other at the end of the day. They've taken a long time to just get really nose to nose. I've got such an itchy nose, I'm really sorry. Still, this was our first look at Harry Reid International as that loud. So this was our first look at Harry Reid International here in Las Vegas. It's a very big airport. Very big indeed. It's not as bad as something like LAX, but... I think the way that LAX is laid out is a lot easier to manage. It's not one of these airports that's sort of on an L shape where everything has to sort of go around one path and it's very difficult to make it all flow in one direction. You know, at LAX, it's quite easy to sort of have stuff coming in from both sides and you can manage the arrivals on different runways. But I do like this. Really good airport, as I've said. Please do take it with a pinch of salt, though. This is still in beta at the moment. There are things being tested. There are things being fixed. But I think it's performed very well, to be honest. Feel there have been very good to me in making me a beta tester and letting me have these airports early. And they're great at supporting the YouTube content as well. And, you know, there's been a lot of people watching the videos as well that have been supporting it. So thank you very much for that. I hope you enjoyed this. And I will hopefully see you in the next episode.